Well, before you head out the door tomorrow morning, you will want to take that winter coat. Kate, winter is reminding us, still hanging on. It, Not quite done yet. It is still winter, Jessica, for the next five, six days. Last work week of winter, and yeah, it is going to feel like it. And even more than that, it may actually look like it at times. We have at least two chances this week to see a wintry mix or at least a few snowflakes. It's not going to amount to much, at least it doesn't look like it will, but it's certainly going to remind us that, well, don't get too used to those 60s and 70s just yet. Tomorrow we'll be lucky to get into the 40s. Outside tonight, it is still blustery, it is still cold. Temperatures are dropping rapidly. We're down to 37 in Philadelphia right now. 30 in Allentown, 34 in Reading, only 22 in Mount Pocono, and 39 in Millville. But winds are still strong. Winds are sustained right now at about 23 miles an hour from the northwest in Philly, 25 miles per hour in Allentown. And again, these are not even gusts. Winds still gusting to over 30 miles per hour in spots overnight tonight. And here's what that means it means when you wake up tomorrow morning, it'll feel like the teens and 20s outside. And even through the afternoon tomorrow, it's not going to feel much. Much better than the 20s and 30s. So, Storm Scan 3 right now showing not a whole lot of anything, just a few snowflakes off across New York State. But here's this major system that brought blizzard conditions to Colorado today. This is going to be heading our way by Tuesday, but it will really lose a lot of moisture by the time it gets here and thus is not expected to bring much in the way of precipitation. But light rain and maybe even some light snow cannot be ruled out. Tonight, 26 degrees, clear, cold, and blustery. For your Monday, this should be Monday. We just switched over as of midnight, but it is going to be a wintry, cold day. Our afternoon highs tomorrow, many spots not making it past the upper 30s. We will likely get to about 41 degrees here in the city. And then as we get into Tuesday, it is cold enough. Once again, temperatures hanging out near the 40 degree mark. Cold enough that we may see some light snow mixing in with the rain here Tuesday afternoon into Tuesday evening. Doesn't look like a big deal. We're not expecting accumulation, but don't be shocked to see some flakes flying on Tuesday. So your eyewitness weather seven day forecast sunny and cold tomorrow. Tuesday still cold with a chance for rain or a wintry mix. St. Patrick's Day Wednesday is more seasonable, but it does stay mainly cloudy. Our best chance to get some appreciable rain comes Thursday into Friday. Could even end as a brief wintry mix Friday. Then spring starts on Saturday, and the good news is it does look like it's going to start feeling more spring like. We're back to the 50s on Sunday, and it looks like another warm up may start early next mm -hmm. week. But Yuki, it looks like a, a little bit of an ugly week here. Some ups and downs, but mostly downs. It's going to be chilly, so bundle up. All righty. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Kate.